Peak Design Clutch is one of the first accessories I get when I get a new camera. I'll explain why today. Hi, this is David of Tech for Baba, a channel I share my experiences on how technology enhances my time with kids and family as a dad. If this is your first time here, welcome. Please consider subscribing. In today's video, let's open up this version 3 Peak Design Clutch Compare it to the version 2 clutch I've been using for years and install it. Besides faster memory cards, this is the first accessory I got for my new Sony A7S III camera. Yeah, I'm one of the lucky ones who pre-ordered and received the new Sony A7S III already. I'm excited to learn a lot with this new camera and capture more videos of my kids. They're growing up just way too fast. I'm somewhat careful with my gears, but the reason I get them is to use them. So I tend to put them and myself in difficult positions just to get a shot. So when I get a new camera, the first thing I think about is how to make sure it doesn't fall out of my hands. The best accessory I've found to do this job is the Peak Design Clutch. I've enjoyed using many Peak Design products. I've done a review of the Peak Design 6 liter sling, which is my go-to camera bag. I've also uploaded a review of the Tech Pouch. Even though we're not traveling or going out too much these days, I actually use the tech pouch every day at home to store and organize my many tech accessories. I'll link both videos here and below in the descriptions so you can check them out. Okay, back to the Peak Design Clutch. The Peak Design Clutch is basically a camera strap around my hand to help me hold the camera more securely. The best feature about it is how it could be quickly adjusted on the fly to fit my hand tightly or loosely as needed. The box comes with the clutch or the strap, an Arcar Swiss plate, a hex wrench to secure the plate, two anchors, and a little pouch. The version 3 clutch has just a couple minor updates from the version 2, similar to other Peak Design products like the leash or the slice strap. Here's the version 3 on the left and my old version 2 on the right. I've used this version 2 clutch for many years. There's a little wear, but it's held up very well. On the top, the end of the strap on the version 3 is changed to a nice red accent stitching with a blackout logo instead of a rubber logo on version 2. On the bottom of the strap, there are additional rubbery patterns on the version 3 to help with more grip. The included anchors have also been updated to the latest with slimmer, easier to operate angled bodies. You only need one anchor, so Peak Design provided one extra as a spare. By the way, if you still have one of the older flat body anchors or version 3 anchors, basically angled body with a thin cord, you can get free replacement version 4 anchors from Peak Design. I'll put this link for the anchor update kit down in the descriptions. To install the clutch, install the anchor mount plate on the bottom of the camera first, after which put one of the anchors on the anchor mount, then detach the clasp with this quick release, Install the strap on the jump ring of the camera, then reattach the clasp. Lastly, you want to loosen up the strap and connect the anchor. That's it. I can now put my hand through the strap to pick up the camera. I can quickly loosen and tighten the strap by lifting the clutch or pulling on the strap. It's very comfortable, not bulky at all, easy to adjust, and most importantly, it helps me to have a much more secure grip on the camera when I'm shooting or just hand carrying the camera around. Instead of having to grip the camera tightly all the time, I can relax my fingers and hands from time to time so my hand is less tired. The clutch works well with other Peak Design products such as the capture clip. I usually add another anchor on the anchor mount plate and another anchor on the other side of the camera so I can attach my Peak Design strap for carrying the camera. The Arcar Switch anchor plate on the bottom fits on many tripods as well, so I can simply mount the camera on a tripod without taking anything off. If I had to nitpick, I wish there is a little Velcro or magnet to keep the excess strap in place so it doesn't dangle around. Not a big deal, but maybe something Peak Design can improve on the next version. At $39.99 US dollars, I think it's a fair price for a very comfortable and secure camera hand strap. Peak Design markets the clutch mainly for larger DSLR cameras, but it also works great on full frame mirrorless cameras like the Sony a7 III or the a7S III I have here. I highly recommend giving it a try if you want a hand strap to help you hold on to your camera more securely like I do. 
Thanks for watching. If you find this video helpful, please smash the like button and share this video with others. If you have any questions about the Peak Design Clutch, leave me a comment below. If you want to see more videos on how technology can enhance our life with kids and family, please subscribe and turn on the bell to be notified when I put out my next video. I'll see you in the next one. Until then, cherish each moment.